Hi, welcome to Slide Dynamic. This is the uh, final preview video for our next release of our PowerPoint add-in, uh, which incorporates the quick and easy addition of online web assets, web pages, and various other online media. Um, what we've already done is um, we've already covered um, embedding a Vimo video and an online Prezi and this is just going to cover uh, both online and offline web pages. Um, so the first thing to do is just to add a slide where we want to put an online web page. There are already add-ins that do this um, but we've taken a slightly different approach in terms of trying to drive some efficiency. Offline web page. Um, so the first thing to do is we need to go and decide what web page we want to embed. So let me just pick um, Yahoo. So normally uh, to embed a web page in a PowerPoint slide, it would involve sort of cut, cutting and pasting uh, the URL here. Uh, we've taken a slightly different approach. So the way we've done it is add it as a favorite. Um, Okay, um, and also what I'll also do here as an example is just go to say Google and what I'll do is I'll just save that, now, obviously you wouldn't do this but um, uh, just placing a, a, an HTML or a Java page somewhere um, on your PC as a local asset, um, we'll just use Google as an example, so we'll close that down. So now back in, in PowerPoint. The idea is we've created our presentation and um, in order to add those assets, if you go to the page, you go to the slide dynamic PowerPoint add-in ribbon menu, click that, and you'll see here the various options. We've already covered the ones that allow you to create sort of non-linear PowerPoint presentation menus. Um, this is around sort of incorporating web, app, web assets. So we've done the, Primo, uh, the Vimo and the Prezi, and this is a web asset. So by clicking it, what it does is it takes you to the favorites where we've just saved, in this case, Yahoo. So we click that, hit select, we have it. And obviously we can resize this, but if I just go into show mode, and there it is. So there is uh, the live web page. So let's just resize that slightly and then go to an offline version and again go to the same insert web asset but instead of going to the favorites we just I think I saved it into my pictures and there it is the Google one so let's click that and click save and there we have it let's just test that and that's the offline version so that's the quick and easy way and obviously um, instead of going backwards and forwards and copying and pasting you can simply go to embed web asset and any favorites that you've saved will obviously just allow you to quickly embed them without copying and pasting. And that's literally it. So you can then go and present, and you can then go and present web pages, um, and you can then go and present offline web pages. Quick and simple, I hope. Thanks.